Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back. So if this is your first time to my channel, they call me Flex, and this is my 2012 Mercedes C250 Coupe. As you can see, I've done a lot of modifications to this car, and if you go to my YouTube channel, I have over 100 videos associated to every single mod that I've done to this car. But for everyone watching this video, today I have a huge announcement. And if you already follow me on Facebook and Instagram, you probably already know what I'm going to say. But the announcement is, I'm finally going to upgrade the turbo on my Mercedes C250 Coupe. And I'm super excited, and I think it's going to be an awesome, fun experience, and I want to share it with you guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a brand new video series that I'm going to call the Turbo Performance Series. So for every video, if you look at the thumbnail of the video, I'm going to put a line that basically says Turbo Performance Series. So that way, you know that that video is associated to doing the turbo upgrade. So you're probably wondering, why am I finally doing the turbo upgrade? Well, after two years of having my YouTube channel and over a hundred different mods to my car, it's about time that I do something that's big, bad, and awesome. And for all you C250 owners out there, you know this car from the factory is very, very underpowered. And to be honest, when you're driving around, it's not that responsive. And all the mods that I've done to date was really to try to combat that and give the car more responsiveness. So by upgrading the turbo on this car, I'm going to get more responsiveness and it's just going to drive overall better on the roads and on the track. So speaking of a track, am I going to be taking the car to a track? Maybe, maybe not. But I do plan on taking my car autocrossing so that way I can have the experience of really enjoying the car and enjoying all the performance upgrades that I have made to this car. So back to the video series, which is going to be a compilation of everything related to the turbo upgrade. So we're going to talk about how the turbo system works in the Mercedes C250 M271 Evo engine. I'm going to talk about all the upgrades that I've already done to the car to support the new turbo upgrade. I'm going to talk about what I plan to do in order to upgrade the turbo and also I'm going to do a full review of the total install and how the car performs and we'll also look at pricing breakdown as well. So hopefully you guys stick around and for the new guys make sure you subscribe because there's going to be a lot of good content you definitely don't want to miss it and I'll see you guys at the next video.